That's enough of all that. Oh, come on. Put that back on. I don't think it's doing us any favours listening to that. What? It's not doing us any favours to know what's going on during the end of the world. Come on. If you don't like the quiet, I have some more CD samples. Yeah, I've already heard the last three since the last stop. I actually think I'm good. Oh, shit, we're running low on petrol. We'll have to make a pit stop in the next town. Oh my god! Oh my god. Sam, what's wrong? Sam! Sam! Oh my god, what was that? Are you serious? Again? Yes, I'm pretty serious. Look at this. Give me the camera. We're living through the greatest natural change in Earth's history. And you would rather just drive through it? Listening to your mixtapes? Oh my god. Hey. Sorry, okay. That wasn't really nice. Just give me five minutes, okay? Sam, do you think we can get going now? Sorry, sorry. It's just... Look at this. Sorry, it's just... Look at this. Can't really miss it. Aren't you scared of it? A little bit, sure. But not like you. Just looking at you, you look terrified, aren't you? Look, I get that this is your job and you're a filmmaker. But I can't believe you're still documenting the thing. Duty of a good filmmaker. Camera poised till the end. I guess I make good footage for everyone when we get back. I think it's pretty cool, your dedication. I guess so. Somewhat, yeah. Causing so much chaos, so much turbulence in people's lives. I was scared at first, when watching your bridge. Once we could recognise it as a planet, at least. That's when the reality sense it of what the future is going to be like. But I get used to it after a while, though. I had to watch it and film it every day, after all. That's where another fear set in. The fear of what's come next, if anything. I felt that one too. Is that why you came from Arcadia? Yes. The team I was working with found that being farther south will give a clear view of the planet as it approached this time of year. So far away from home. Yeah. Yeah, precisely. But what was it exactly that brought you to Arcadia then? Considering it's even further from your home than mine. I was planning a trip with some college friends. We planned to travel the country. And then I had a phone call about my mum and dad. They were sick. Oh, so I'm sorry to hear about your dad. I had to cut the trip short and make my way back home. How long were you on the road trip for? About five months. Then we cut it short to two months. Wow! How did you afford it? It must have been so expensive. Well, this is it. That's the easy part. I used to do gigs, gigs in pubs and that paid. So you're a musician? Yeah, I play guitar. That's so cool. You have to play with something sometime. Maybe. One day. It's parked away in the car. I guess we should be going now. Oh, 
Christine, what, what's wrong? You forgot to turn off the ignition. Chasing after that. You run dry, Sam. I didn't ask you to follow me, okay? No, but you weren't. You, you keep doing this, making a stop to look at that. What? You're just selfish. You are. You knew we had some way to be. But all you care about is yourself, not about our family. If I am selfish, you're an idiot and you're definitely a coward. No. No, how could you call me that? When all I've done is try to be good to you. Are you kidding me? You can't even look at the damn thing, Austin. Where are you living? Cloud Cuckoo Land? Oh, Sammy will be fine once we get home. You refuse to accept that this is it. Once we get there, there's nothing. Matter of time, we're dead, Justin. Just dead, okay? There's nothing wrong in being an optimist. Oh my God, you're not being optimist. You're in denial. I'm done with you. At least I'm not giving up. Am I? Yes. Look, can we drop the attention? We've still got a long way to go. If you can actually look at me in the face, yeah, fine. So, what's next? Well, I guess we rest up here for tonight and then head up in the morning, if we can rescue the car. I think we both need time out, don't you? So you'd be raiding us bikes or something? You're so desperate to keep going. Maybe. I mean well, and I know you do too. Yeah, we, we're pretty different, I guess. I mean, we both, I mean, we... So maybe we should call it quits. Okay. That's where you get to go home, and I, I need to live, Austin, okay? We can't keep forcing each other, going in our own direction. It doesn't work like that. Guess you're going alone then. <sighs> it's for the best. So maybe we should call it quits. Okay. That's what she wants. Quite sensible, actually. It's what I'm meant to do. I will be alone.